welcome everyone. This is Melissa Arma with the Stock Swish and I'm reviewing the Foot Locker, which we did as a day trade on Friday, but really was the option so far here of the week. Uh, because I called the 31 puts on Friday in this and this fell off the planet today. Gap down today, beautiful trade. Again, almost at $28. Looks like it's going to get there. Almost $3 for the strike. And again, I always tell people, give trades a chance to work. That is why you have to be very specific about how you size your trades. If you oversize your trades, you'll kill something. Because this was down initially on Friday when it rallied, and then it went on to work. And I always say, try to give trades a chance to work. Again, a lot of people, I think, just risk too much money in trades, and then they kill them. This ended up being a really nice trade. You could be out of this here. You could still be in this here. Um, it was more than 100% if you got out of it today. And again, beautiful gap. So let's just take a look and go back. Thursday night, the stock closed at 41.52. Open in the morning at 30.65. And again, that's where I called the 31 puts. So it did close nicely on Friday. Did I know it would open today at 29.15? No. So today it was $2 through the strike, almost $3 through the strike here. And again, 28 looks like it's going to get there. We still have plenty of time left in the day if anyone's still in it. So the nice thing about doing options is, and one of the most uh, beneficial things I bet, or the most uh, rewarding thing about doing options is for people, is that you can take a fixed risk in a stock, okay, or the market. We trade the market ETFs too with a fixed risk, a limited risk, when you do and capture an overnight move when you do an option. So one of the biggest rewards to doing options is you can capture overnight moves, but you can also do that with a fixed risk. So in other words, if this trade would have completely reversed, not even worked at all, and you risked $500, that's all you would have lost. Like if you would have woke up, woken up today, if you would have done the trade Friday and the stock would have been in $100, you only would have lost $500 if that's what you risked in total in the position. And so that's nice. If it works in your favor, again, if you risk $500 on Friday and it works in your favor, today you would have been up more than $500. Again, you were able to capture the new overnight move. The stock did not go to 28 something on Friday. So you got the move from Friday to Monday in the overnight position with a fixed risk. Uh, so I think it's it's very interesting, this market and the times that we're trading right now. You have to get the good ones. I've always been focused on getting the good ones, but even more than, than ever right now in 2023, you must be focused on the good ones in order to make money. The market's too choppy, and if you need the market for your trades, you're not going to do well. So Foot Locker was on its own. We did it. Again, This is a, the Options Newsletter is a subscription service. There aren't any prerequisites. You can sign up for the newsletter without ever having taken any of my classes. I do think the Golden Gap course is helpful to the newsletter. Would have allowed you to hold this trade probably and hold it more, seeing how good the gap rating was. But you, if you just want an option subscription service, you can sign up for it standalone. It's on the website. It's www.thestockswish.com if you want to find out more information. So congratulations to everyone that did the Foot Locker. I think a lot of people did. And again, it's on its way to 28. Plenty of time left in the day. Could even go lower. Good luck, everyone that's still in the Foot Locker. And we will look for the next big option call this week. Have a good day.